नमस्कार आई एम डी वेलकम यू न्यूज डेली वेदर ब्रीफिंग प्रोग्राम टुडे सिक्स मार्च ए बी सी स्टडीज रियलाइज्ड वेदर सो लाइट टू मॉडरेट रेनफॉल स्नोफॉल एट आइसोलेटेड टू स्कैटर्ड प्लेसेस रिपोर्टेड ओवर हिमाचल प्रदेश एंड ओवर अरुणाचल प्रदेश एंड आइसोलेटेड रेनफॉल इज रियलाइज वेरी लाइट टू लाइट रेनफॉल रियलाइज ओवर उड़ीसा अंडमान निकोबार लैंड एंड ट्रेस रेनफॉल ऑल्सो रिपोर्टेड ओवर केरला एंड सम पार्ट्स ऑफ सब एलैंड सब हिमालयन वेस्ट बंगाल अदरवाइज ओवर एनी पार्ट्स ऑफ द कंट्री नो सिग्निफिकेंट रेन रिपोर्टेड स्टडे एज रिगार्ड टेम्परेचर सीनेरियो सो मिनिमम टेम्परेचर्स आर नॉर्मल टू ब्लो नॉर्मल ओवर मोस्ट पार्ट्स ऑफ नॉर्थ वेस्ट एंड डेजोनिंग सेंट्रल इंडिया एज रिगार्ड्स मैक्सिमम टेम्परेचर दे आर ऑल्सो नॉर्मल टू ब्लो नॉर्मल ओवर मोस्ट पार्ट्स ऑफ नॉर्थ वेस्ट इंडिया एंड नॉर्मल टू अब नॉर्मल ओवर महाराष्ट्र एंड साउथ पेनसुलर इंडिया ए बी सी टूडे इज हाईलाइट सो एज रिगार्ड्स हाईलाइट सो मेनली ड्राई वेदर इज एक्सपेक्टेड ओवर मोस्ट पार्ट्स ऑफ द कंट्री ड्यूरिंग नेक्स्ट फाइव टू सेवन डेज एक्सेप्ट आइसोलेटेड टू स्कैटर्ड लाइट टू मॉडरेट रेनफॉल स्नोफॉल इज एक्सपेक्टेड ओवर अरुणाचल प्रदेश एंड वेस्टर्न हिमालय रीजन स्पेशली जम्मू कश्मीर लद्दाख हिमाचल प्रदेश एंड उत्तराखंड टूडे एंड टुमारो दैट इज ऑन सिक्स एंड सेवन मार्च एंड ऑल्सो अंडर द इन्फ्लुएंस ऑफ ए फ्रेश वेस्टर्न डिस्टर्बेंस फ्रॉम द नाइट ऑफ टेंथ और लाइट टू मॉडरेट रेनफॉल स्नोफॉल इज एक्सपेक्टेड ओवर वेस्टर्न हिमालय रीजन स्पेशली ओवर जम्मू कश्मीर लद्दाख हिमाचल प्रदेश एंड उत्तराखंड डूरिंग द पीरियड ऑफ टेन टू ट्वेल्थ हाउ वी हैव नॉट मैंशन दिस लाइन बट ए फ्रेश स्पेल इज एक्सपेक्टेड ओवर हिल्स वेस्टर्न हिल्स डूरिंग द पीरियड ऑफ टेन टू ट्वेल्थ सो दीज आर द हाईलाइट्स Now we see today's synoptic system. So there is a western disturbance, uh, roughly 62 degree east and uh, 32 degree north, uh, roughly over Afghanistan uh, and uh, adjoining Iran region. And uh, there is a cyclone circulation over north west Uttar Pradesh and adjoining Haryana in lower troposphere levels. And another cyclone circulation over east Assam and Uh, one cyclone circulation over south Odisha. So these are three cyclone circulations in uh, lower troposphere levels, and uh, there is a trough runs from South Tamil Nadu to eastern parts of Jharva across uh, uh, the region of interior Karnataka and Rajasthan and Telangana in lower troposphere levels. So these are the some of the synoptic systems. However, uh, this western disturbance is in uh, not in so much active positions. Therefore, only Uh, light to moderate rainfall is no fall is expected over uh, western himalayan region especially over jammu kashmir and himachal pradesh and isolated rainfall is expected over uttarakhand region today and tomorrow otherwise uh, no significant weather is expected over plains of northwest india under the influence of this uh, western disturbance as regards northeast india so under the influence of this cyclone circulation and the movement of this western disturbance are uh, this uh, uh, rainfall uh, snow fall is expected over arunachal pradesh and sikkim region during next two days and uh, under the influence of this cyclone circulation and favorable anti cyclonic flow over bay of bengal this isolated active act, isolated activity is expected over odisha during the next 2 to 3 days so these are some of the uh, synoptic systems so now let us day by day see the rainfall expectation so this is day 1 that is valid for uh, uh, today and uh, till tomorrow 8:30 hours igst so isolated rainfall is expected over jammu kashmir himachal pradesh today and isolated as already mentioned that uh, over uttarakhand and isolated uh, to scattered activity is expected over north parts of north east india especially over assam meghalaya arunachal pradesh and adjoining sikkim regions and otherwise this uh, as already mentioned over odisha and andaman nicobar islands and some possibility of uh, light rainfall over kerala today and no significant weather warning has been issued for any parts of the country except uh, uh, thunderstorm activity is expected over arunachal pradesh and light to moderate thunderstorm activity is expected over a uh, western nepal region accordingly no weather warning has been issued for any parts of the country if we see the rainfall and forecast warning for next uh, uh, next uh, and that is day after tomorrow on valid for 7th so it is uh, seen here isolated activity is expected to continue over uh, western nepal region jammu kashmir ladakh himachal pradesh uttarakhand and the same scenario likely to continue over arunachal pradesh sikkim and isolated rainfall is expected over gangetic west bengal and odisha otherwise on 7th there is no weather warning issued for any parts of the country if we see the weather warning and uh, forecast for uh, day 3 that is valid for 8 so uh, there is no significant rain, uh, rain is expected over any parts of the country except isolated uh, possibility over odisha coastal andhra pradesh and parts of north east india including arunachal pradesh and adjoining regions of uh, uh, gangetic west bengal uh, southern and west bengal and sikkim region otherwise uh, uh, there is no weather warning for 8th of march 
and uh, more or less same scenario likely to continue on 9th accelerated activity respect of Arunachal Pradesh, Odisha and coastal Andhra Pradesh and no weather warning. On 10th, uh, under the influence of a fresh western disturbance, isolated activity is expected to continue from 9th, uh, night of 10th over Jammu Kashmir, Arunachal Pradesh and Uttarakhand and uh, isolated activity is expected over Arunachal Pradesh and coastal Andhra Pradesh and no weather warning has been issued for 10th of March also. So this is uh, all about today. Let us summarize again. There is no significant weather warning issued for any parts of the country except light water rainfall, thunderstorm activity over Arunachal Pradesh and Western, Western Himal region, Jammu Kashmir, Himachal Pradesh and Uttarakhand today. Otherwise, there is no weather warning for any parts of the country. As regards hot and humid weather, hot and humid weather is expected over Rail Sima and Kerala region today and tomorrow. So this is all about today's briefing. We will update further tomorrow. Till then, Namaskar, Jain Jai Bharat.